greeting everyone we are all gathered here for an exciting event it is the book launch of unforgettable incidents authored by nine young and talented in fact i would say prodigious authors uh, from various parts of the world in fact two are from middle east and then the remaining seven are from india so aren't we all delighted to have these young authors and to perform the book launch we have chief guest pramila raj ma'am and also we have guests of honor coach manita gupta who is also a trainer icf coach and also a toast master and we have editor kriba jacob kriba jacob always wanted to work in the realm of books so she quit her job as a civil engineer and became an editor for the last 5 years she has been working as an editor isn't it interesting to have an editor also amidst us and we have another author pm unni in our midst in fact his uh, latest book uh, his first book that is kitchi tales is a latest uh, sensation on amazon it became 12th uh, best selling book in uh, anthologies and short stories section let's also congratulate him because he was the one who did the proof reading for all our young writers so let's thank him also and let's get started with the official book launch by chief guest pramila raj ma'am is a person uh, whom i admire a lot you know why at the age of 68 she is still running marathons can you imagine a person 68 years in fact she has run 107 marathons from the age of 50 or 54 till now of course when she was younger it seems as per her uh, tradition right her in-laws told her because she got married at the age of 18 and then only she finished her education okay so they told her being a married woman don't run marathons and all that it looks very odd but her husband was encouraging and her son also and now she runs marathons uh, 107 marathons so shall we put a clap sign to appreciate pramila ma'am shall we all put a clap sign on uh, zoom yes thank you not see that it's not just uh, uh, her athletic prowess that impresses me but her ability uh, to transcend any kind of difficulty that life uh, puts in front of her her husband uh, died of cancer currently she is helping brother inspiring him in his fight against cancer again uh, pramila raj ma'am has won national award for the best teacher from none other than legendary dr abdul kalam isn't that amazing let's put a heart sign for ma'am heart sign on zoom for ma'am additionally she also won fulbright nehru fellowship from uh, usa and she actually worked in new york as well while working in new york she also ran marathon in uh, new york at the age of 54 now you know why i admire her i request everyone else to go on mute because uh, you know we will have a guest pramila raj ma'am do the honors and the best thing about this particular uh, book cover is that for the book cover lot of young authors have spent uh, their cre- uh, i would say spend their hours thinking about what kind of book cover would suit our book they have only designed it and then final finishing touches only the, the publisher and the other designers have given so i would like to appreciate uh, all the young children involved in the book cover designs as well and i would like to appreciate avantika specifically because finally her version is what we modified and then tweaked to make it into the final cover okay so she is only in 600 avantika is also present so shall we now unveil the book cover we have three versions also for ebook we'll be using one of them and for the paperback we may use another one so uh, author pm unni he has uh, kindly agreed to help me as the uh, zoom co-host by sharing the this so we'll see three different versions of the uh, book cover as well and we will have guest pramila raj ma'am do a virtual book launch
so uh, author only we are still not able to see the uh, are others able to see the book if you can see you can type yes in the chat window are you able to see the book Uh, we used to see it previously, but not now. Okay, okay. So, yeah, we'll try again. Yeah. Yes, now it's <clears throat> visible. Okay, fantastic. Yeah. Okay. So, ma'am, uh, we would now like to uh, request you to virtually launch the book and congratulate the authors. Now it's a pleasure to launch this book and all my best wishes to the children and to the coach who have helped these children to come out in flying colors. Writing a book is no easy job and it's great appreciation and I laud the efforts of these budding blossoms for the great effort which has been put by them. Congratulations, children. Thank you so much, ma'am. Thank you so much. So as per protocol, since she's a national body, we have to uh, let her speak at the last only. So ma'am, we'll be calling you again. We'll have to follow the protocol, especially with the national body in the uh, in our midst. We have to follow the protocols. We'll call you again, ma'am, towards the end. Now let's move on to Coach Manita Gupta to address the gathering. Coach Manita Gupta has taken an ICF, International Coach Federation Certification. She's also a wonderful orator. In fact, she won a speech contest recently. I saw her uh, work on her speech. It's like an impromptu speech. So there's no time to think. You just give a topic and immediately you have to start speaking. So she spoke really effortlessly with great accent. In fact, she in her first attempt, in her maiden attempt, she became the star of the show. So I was really mesmerized by her performance and I really asked her could you come and address the young authors today so coach Manita is your internet cooperating if so please do come and address author PM Muni you can stop sharing thank you so much coach Manita Gupta is having internet issues also so we'll have to bear with it because she's having uh, you know she's uh, coming from one to one. yeah so we'll try spotlighting. Yeah, Coach Manita. Yes, uh, over to what Coach. So greetings for the day, everyone. This is a dream come true. Let me first address the chief guest, Pramila Raj. It's an honor, ma'am, to it have a awesome. safe sharing with you. What a dream come true, truly. With these budding authors, and their proud parents. Of course, the guest of honor with me, uh, this is Kiruba. So I am really amazed. And Manju ma'am, who has given an incredible introduction of mine, but believe me, it's like I'm not standing anywhere in front of you people. So thank you so much, Manju K. Manohar ma'am, that you have invited me to this event. With a click of mine, I just had it author's book launch, okay? I could see aged people with experiences, jotting down words and having their book launches. And when she came up and she told me, it's the young people. So I said, all right, maybe college pass like around, or maybe, you know, 28, 30 young people. She's like, they're kids. And I'm like, and they're authors. And yes, when I saw the banner that came out, the posters, you young authors, I got mesmerized seeing you people. My God, talented that you are. I wouldn't even say budding authors, because you know, when you're budding, you're still onto the verge of creating things. But God, you have already done it all. Hats off and a very proud moment for each and everyone who's present here because we are getting to witness these young people. Now, very quickly, with the one, two, three, four, five, six, I think there are nine of you. Can I just have you people? And if you can share one adjective for yourself, starting from your initial. 
Oh, we have author Vivan. Hello, Vivan. So this is going to be a 10 seconds game for all of you because your authors and you must be full of vocabulary, right? Words and all. So one word describing you starting from your initial. Can we have it? Yes, ma'am. Oh, great going. So let's go for it. And your time starts now. Ma'am, can you tell the question again? Okay. You need to describe yourself with one adjective, which is starting from your initial. Like you have Vivan, V for Vivan. So V for Thank something you. in your personality. And if you can't do it, Vivan, I'm ready because I was so excited for all of you. Okay, ma'am. Mm. Just I think we can start with A because V is really tough. Even I was thinking what to tell with I this. actually had to search for you, Vivan. I know. <laughs> I yes, we can go with Avantika. Yeah. So, author okay. Avantika. How much would you describe? Ma'am, I think I would describe it as adaptable Avantika. Wow. And yes, you would be because you have to write a book. You have to be adaptable. And I have written ambitious Avantika. A person, an author who has great planning for future. So can we come to you, author Nitisha? Are you ready? Okay, Nitisha, I have something for you. So I address you as author Nitisha, never failing. Because you know how to reach your way. Yes, you're an author now. Author Vivan, let me help you. So V for versatile. When you need to write books, you have to have variety of thoughts and variety of flavors and variety of, I don't know what all, which you have in you. And that's why you're an author. So versatile Vivan. What we left with, if we can have some more authors here. We had author Gautam. Is yeah. he here? No, author Gautam. Gautam. Uh, yeah, author Gautam. Yeah. Never mind. I can just till the time. Uh, it's like time is running short. So what I can do is whatever I have designed. So I called him game sum. Maybe he's playful. Maybe he's sporty. I wish I could see him on screen. And there is author uh, Anaswara. Am I pronouncing it right? Uh, Anaswara. Yeah. yeah. Anaswara. So affable, good natured and friendly. Okay. Then we have... Nish, uh, Nishet, I guess even he is not here, must be arriving soon. Yes, right? I think so we just have typed in the chat Nishti. window. Nifty Nishit. Oh, that's great. Yeah, actually, okay. some of the children are not able to turn on the video because some are traveling. One no. is in hospital, so it's like a bit of a uh, difficult ah. scenario. And two of the authors, Aneshwar and Zia, are in Middle East, so they have exams today. It's a Sunday, is a working day for them, unfortunately. No worries, ma'am. All to do after finally, they are authors. They need yes. to be addressed. Yes. So, Nivesh, I did have no way for you. Strong and courageous, which at the moment is really going along with your circumstances. And yes, we have Trishna, talented one. Yes. Then it was Priyank. Okay. You get it? Cheerful, happy, and making others all happy. Yes. Last but not the least, we have Shia. A Z came in the picture. I got zappy for her. Energetic and lively. Because see the flavors that you need to add into your words. The flavors that you, you need to add in your books to make it really readable by all. And I wish you all the very best, dear authors. This is a lovely evening. I'm sure I will enjoy here. Manju, ma'am, thank you so much for having me here. I'm delighted. I would love to carry on for the evening. And all the very best. I'll make it a point that I do read the books. At your age, I could only think of chocolates. <laughs> so congratulations. Yes. So shall we put an adjective with M for Coach Manita. Can you think of an adjective with M for Coach Manita? I think Avantika is trying to type. You can tell an adjective. Like when you say beautiful is an adjective, you know, like that. For Manita, ma'am, what adjective comes to your mind? You can type in the chat window. <laughs> yeah, I think Nishit Balia ji has put marvelous. 
Marvelous, uh, Manita. Yes. Let's hear from the other authors. It can be any, okay. It needn't be with M itself. You can start with A, A also. A or B or C, any, any alphabet. Magical Manita. That is by author Avantika. Majestic Manita by author Nishit Balaji. Uh, Mitisha, Priyank, others, if you are in a position to type, I know some of you are traveling or maybe in hospital, etc. If you are not able to type, no problem. Author Priyank Bama says motivational. Motivational Manita. <laughs> okay. Thank you. I'm honored. <laughs> yes. Coach Manita, I would like to add on mine. I would like to tell you are a multi multifarious, multi-faceted, magnanimous coach Manita because at short notice within three days, she agreed to reschedule stuff and come on a Sunday to motivate these youngsters. Now you know why I invited her, right? Because she's like this, you know, always very bubbly, energetic, enthusiastic. And I would say it's like, you know, her nature is very effervescent. You know the word effervescent? Like we have this Coke and all and you open, no? There will be like, so she's like that. Don't you think so? She's like that? Yes. Okay, so let's put a heart sign for Coach Manita to say thanks. Okay, shall we put a heart sign? I'm putting a heart sign. Yes. Coach Unni, uh, sorry, I'm troubling. So I just got disconnected. So I'm putting a heart sign. Yeah. Let's put heart sign Vivan, Neetisha, Avantika. You can put a heart sign for Coach Manita. Yes. Okay. Thank you, Ninita, ma'am, also for joining us. Yeah. Okay. Others also. Yes. Thank you so much. Yeah. Okay. So now, uh, Manita, ma'am, we request you to stay back for some time. We have some certificates to distribute and also if you can be there, that would be really great. We also have a certificate for you also. I'm right here, ma'am. Would really not want to leave this platform. <laughs> okay. Thank you so much. So now, what we'll do is we'll have Certificate distribution for the authors by our chief guest, uh, Pramila Raj, ma'am. Okay. And uh, then we'll see if Kriba Jacob, ma'am, is there. She'll address the crowd. Then we'll have some more certificates to be distributed uh, for the, uh, the people who worked behind the screens. Uh, Adira, she, she's an engineer. She also won uh, President's Gold uh, medal. She won a gold medal from the president while she was at school. Yes, she's a young achiever. Atira T. She's a Toastmaster, a wonderful orator, and she held with the proofreading of the book as well. Okay, so we'll honor these after honoring the young authors. Okay, so inviting guests, uh, our chief, Pramila ma'am, to do the honors of. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. <laughs> So we'll have some of the certificates being handed over by Coach Manita also. We'll take turns uh, in doing this. So first, um, let me spotlight. Yes. Okay. And uh, we request author PM Uni, author of Kids Details. He's, uh, he has so uh, graciously agreed to help us with the Zoom co-hosting also because I'm facing some internet issues here. So he said, I'll help you. <laughs> That's how we do, right? We work, uh, help each other towards achieving success, right? So that is Avantika B and I'm going to spotlight Pramila ma'am and author Avantika, yes. Okay, so hope we can take a screenshot photo. Ma'am, that is author Avantika. She wrote yes, Race Against Time. <laughs> Avantika ma'am, yes. Yes. Congratulations, ma'am. Yes. Congratulations, Avantika, for your wonderful Thank performance. You. Excellent Thank work. You. Yes. <laughs> ma'am has also written the foreword. Yes. So, Anashura Anil is not there today because of her exams. Mm -hmm. uh, Sunday is a working day for her. So, thank you so much, author Avantika. So, now we will move on to Anashura Anil. Mm -hmm. Yes. So this is Not a course on creative writing. Yeah. Creative writing, designing and collaborating. And uh, this, this particular certificate is only for being the author of the book, Unforgettable Incidents. Uh, in the third week of February, once the paperback publishing is done, we'll be releasing the 
win you know for every category the most punctual player the most creative uh, student all those awards will be released by the third week of february third or fourth week of february once the paperback uh, copy is ready by the publisher so thank you so much anashura anil now we move on gautam aram gautam aram i would request his mom to receive the prize on us behalf because gautam is away on a uh, school related event so thank uh, you thank gautam's you. mom right. or dad yeah <laughs> ma'am would you be able to come on video yeah yeah yes ma'am <laughs> Okay, Gautam's uh, mom, Mohana, oh. ma'am, is there? And father. Congratulations, ma'am. That's wonderful. You. Your son has done an excellent job. Thank you, ma'am. Thank, Thank you so much. By the heading, ma'am. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Be kind. <laughs> <laughs> ma'am, he's uh, he's a bit humorous. Uh, feel like that, you know, when the examiner comes near us. Yes, yes ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. Oh, Thank you so much. Ma Quite yeah. impressed by it. <laughs> ma'am uh, he 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 is a uh, bit humorous even in class also he uh, is you know we had an assignment for all the children where uh, you had to uh, read ruskin bonds a face in the dark ah uh, yes <laughs> and then you had to come up with your alternate endings so in that uh, gautam what he did he twisted the story and finally uh gautam is the you know he's like the he's psycho killer or something you know he made it into psycho uh, thriller horror kind of <laughs> he rewrote the story ma'am so yeah thank you thank you so much ma'am yes congratulations thank, thank you, you ma'am proud thank parents <laughs> so next thank we you so have much. thank yes. you so much ma'am so next we have the next author so author nitisha nitisha she is already the so fallen feathers yes fallen feathers her writing is really you know i saw her first line and in that first line itself i fell in love with her write up because she said on a cold wintry morning i was like wow and she's fallen in south feathers. india okay so she has not really seen the winters but she has written it like on a cold wintry morning right that was the first line that's creativity ma'am yes yes <laughs> So Nitisha V, congratulations! Congratulations! Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> she is in sixth standard. My God, ah! Avantika is That's also awesome. in sixth standard. Yeah, Avantika is also in sixth standard. Yeah. So next is Nishit Balaji. So Nishit, I think uh, towards mm -hmm. the end, I hope uh, once he comes on video, we'll again try to bring him. Back. the boon of friendship yes boon of friendship nishit balaji has written boon of friendship and uh, i think he has written it like a movie story kind of <laughs> if you read it no if you, i think the other members of the audience also once you read a story you see it's like a movie story he's having some flashback and stuff like that <laughs> happening <laughs> so uh, nishit balaji is, uh, he had created a very i would say a magnificent poster marketing poster which when i put up on instagram many adults also approached me and said who created this i said he is a child he is a student uh, in 8th standard studying in hosu doni international school so he designed it so people were like wow this looks professional so you know it's not just writing ma'am the children are you know talented in multiple areas like multiple say areas. yeah avantika yeah, she designed uh, you know the book cover uh, and we just took it and modified it so a lot of talent we saw in this particular group so after nishit balaji we would like to have priyank amar yeah priyank bamar priyank are you able to come on video fill in the brims uh, with joy Priyanka, yes, I'll just try, ma'am. Yes, yes. Please try, please try. Yeah, because people are facing internet issue also. So Priyank did mention at the beginning that he's having internet trouble. Yes. Okay. Just a minute, ma'am. Sorry. Yeah, 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 yeah. Anyway, it was wonderful. Your yes. Headache. Yeah. Now I'm very curious to find out what is the joy. Yeah. Bringing yeah, with yeah. joy. What's the joy? Yes, I know. Yes, 
Okay, so Priyank is there with us now. So I'm just adding him to the spotlight. Yeah, that's Priyank. So he, uh, you know, embarked on this journey despite being in 12th standard. Before he enrolled, I was like, are you really sure? Because his ma'am from PSBB Millennium only told him about this course and she was telling that she, he could do. But I was a bit nervous because he's in 12th standard. How would he manage uh, the schedule, you know, the schedule of 12th standard board preparation? But I, I was amazed at his commitment, ma'am. Despite all his pre-board exams and all, he completed his writing and then we had some individual coaching based on which he again fine-tuned his writing. So I was amazed that this young gentleman... Uh, okay, just a minute. Yeah, uh, he, this young gentleman who's at the cusp of adulthood is like 17, going to be 17, right, Priyank? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Uh, I'm 17 already. 17 already, yeah. So he's at the cusp of adulthood and he's so committed. Despite his pre board exams and all, he met the timelines. So that was, you know, I felt like, you know, hats off to you, Priyank Bummer. For that kind of amazing dedication, not everyone could have done that. Being in 12th, having pre-board exams, meeting a writing deadline. And that too, uh, you know, I uh, asked him to change it a lot. You know, I'm, I'm not an easy coach also. <laughs> then he went through all those changes and then rewrote it. So it is not easy, but he made it. So hats off to you, Priyank, for your commitment, dedication and your amazing writing. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Special congratulations to you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. Yes. <laughs> so next we have author Trishna. Author Trishna, would you be able to come on video? Trishna Venugopal. Trishna Venugopal from Mumbai. And no, she's having an uh, unstable network. She's traveling also, so she's unable to come on. So Trishna, would you able to would you be uh, able to at least say thank you to uh, Coach Minka and Pramila Ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Can you hear me, ma'am? Yes, yes. Congratulations. Thank you, ma'am. Yes, great, great work by you on right smile and spreading positivity. Yes, ma'am. Okay. So next we have Kabini, Vivan, Yeah, Vivan and Zia. So I would request Coach Manita also to come on video to uh, honor Vivan along with uh, Pramila ma'am. Vivan, are you there? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Fantastic. Yes. So Vivan, uh, you know, he's like just in fifth standard. Can you imagine being yeah. a fifth standard uh, student and then writing uh, something and it's not like uh, see in our course we are very strict it's not like you can just write two paragraphs and all <laughs> Zia knows it well all others know if you give two paragraphs I'll talk to them ask them question uh, then we have some technique right mind mapping and then certain other techniques we'll keep expanding so finally the article he has written you'll be amazed just read the book okay and forget it you'll be amazed at the kind of you know everyone has written almost like thousand <laughs> words or more or more everyone everyone yeah but that means they have put in a lot of hard work all the credit goes to the young children and of course their parents because with respect to Vivan and all because being in fifth standard it's very difficult for him to even join on zoom do some of the assignment because we give canva design assignments book cover design you have to do so he did not know canva so I want to thank all the other children also who were like mentors to Vivan right Vivan would you like to thank any of those your mentors who helped you Yes, ma'am. Zia yes. and Trishna. Uh, Zia, that's all, ma'am. Zia and Gautam. Gautam, yes. Because uh, these other children, no, they pitched in and helped this young warrior, Vivan. Vijay working together. Vivan. Yeah, working together, collaboration. And they helped him. And then he came up with beautiful designs. So I was uh, really touched by that kind of gesture you know, where people pitch in, help each other help and each other. then unleash, yeah, unleash the creativity of the group. So Vivan's journey was really difficult because uh, he had uh, not used computer till this fifth standard. He, he hadn't used Word, he hadn't used Google Doc, he hadn't used Canva, entire technology. Even these things were very tough because in his school, they hadn't introduced that uh, subject yet. 
so it is very difficult but he did not give up <laughs> and you know with the help of all the other mentors within the group he made it happen i wish to thank his mom also because sometimes his uh, word document used to be sent by his mom because he didn't have an email id can you imagine he didn't have an email id so his mom used to send it so i wish to thank his parents also even would you like to thank your parents too yes ma'am the amazing support especially in emailing the google doc and all that right yes ma'am okay. <laughs> okay so thank you so much vivacious vivan with a vivid thank imagination thank you ma'am vivid and vibrant imagination yeah. Yeah, krishna Uh, yeah, and the last, last, last uh, person is Zia Ramis. Yes, Zia Ramis joins us from UAE, but unfortunately, I think because of working day, right, Sunday being a working day, uh, he's not able to join in. So he wrote about an incident that happened in his real life, something which happened when he was just seven years old, but he says that. that incident remains etched in his memory and it completely changed his perspective about various things pertaining to life so it is it is a bit philosophical it is also you know he had some humor also in it he says you know in his writing um first when he gave he just wrote it very briefly when i asked him question then he said uh, i was sleeping and this man with a uh, you know little slightly bald a uh, man with blue t-shirt came and woke me i i just got up shocked okay and then he says that bald man was his father <laughs> i was laughing out loud <laughs> you know the way he the way he puts it though is bit humorous by nature also so when you read his article you know see each child's article reflects their unique nature imagination, yes, unique imagination nature. yeah so uh, if you see avantika's race against time you will see her personality she is a perfectionist she is a perfectionist so it's not every day that she is late for anything so a race against time is a very rare thing for her whereas for me as a child probably it would have been the same every day you should ask my mom mom my mom is there in this court she know manju don't be late don't be late that that was the common refrain in my house but avantika is a perfectionist proficiency award winner etc so each child you know when you read the articles you will realize that it is a uh, it these are not just thousand words from them these are i would say slices of their life their character you can see their character coming out through the lines you know how you <laughs> narrated a bald headed man with blue teeth i'm sure his father would be angry for describing him like that but i could see the humor you all laughed no when he said that that was my father right yeah the father was telling wake up Okay, so each and every child's article or Gautam, if you see, dear examiner, please be kind. I think every teacher who reads it would laugh because that's what he wrote in his exam sheet. It seems <laughs> so. It's really funny. Uh, some of the articles are really philosophical, like Anushuras, right? First, you have to fall in love with yourself. Fallen leaves by Nitisha is another philosophical take. A real life incident. Some of these stories, these are real life. These are unforgettable really incidents from their own life. Okay, so now I wish to thank uh, both our guests, uh, Chief Guest Pramila Raj, Coach Manita for being here for encouraging the children. I would like to check whether Kriba Jacob, our other uh, guest of honor, whether she is there because then we'll have her speech. Then move on for further certificates. so kriba jacob are you present so i wish to thank all the authors as well uh, for their efforts and for their vivacious presence today so kriba jacob are you present would you be able to turn on your video i can see her but she said she is having some internet issues kriba jacob are you able to turn on your video okay never mind uh, we'll just move on with the rest of the thing and we'll come back to her so let's move on with the uh, contest winners certificate uh, author pm muni requesting your uh, kind help yes so this particular contest was held 
uh, this was actually for adults. This is about my upcoming book. My upcoming book is Step by Step. It's a series of books for young students and young employees about leadership topics. So uh, the first book is Conflict Management because one of the things that I've noticed as a manager, senior manager in Infosys, when we deal with the youngsters, they are achievers. Some of them get 100 out of 100, gold medal, etc. But when you ask them to work in a team, in an organization, right? That's when things start unraveling. Interpersonal issues, conflict, etc. So this is a short book describing the ways in which you can manage conflict and also prevent conflict. Sometimes we do make mistakes, but when we make mistakes, a, a kindergarten student knows the right way word to uh, you know kind of solve the conflict. And that simple word is called sorry. But as we become adults, right, we forget to use that word, correct? We forget that sorry. You know, people that ego comes to me. How can I say sorry to someone much younger than me? Why should I say sorry? Let him say sorry first, etc. comes in. And then what happens at our organizations, right? Conflict ensues. And then people are not able to work together. Companies spend a lot of money just to solve conflicts or even resolve conflicts, etc. So I thought a book on that topic would be good. With respect to the book, which will be coming out in March, I thought of having a contest about real world conflicts at workplace. So this contest was won by two people. Nihamatullah, who had worked in Vipro, he's into management. So he's the, but today he's traveling. So I think his daughter would be receiving the prize on his behalf. His daughter is in 12th standard. So I would like to invite uh, his daughter to receive the prize. So would you be able to come on video? Uh, yeah, ma'am. Okay, sure. So I would need help. Yeah, Khadija Nuha. Khadija Nuha. So he, she would be receiving the prize on her father's behalf. Okay, so let me add this youngster, Khadija Nuha. Thank you so much, Khadija, for joining. I know your father is traveling for work, right? He did message me. Thank you so much for being here and for receiving this award. Please do convey this. And of course, we'll be sending the gift to his address. Yeah, ma'am. Thank yes. you. Yes. And I request all the guests, uh, chief guests and uh, Coach Manita and Kriba Jacob to bless Khadija because she's in 12th standard. Please bless her for her upcoming words as well. Yes, ma'am. All our blessings for her, ma'am. Let her come out in flying colors and achieve all her dreams. All the best. Thank you. All the very best to you. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Yeah. So next we'll have the next winner. So Srimati Vimala Nandakumar. I'm not sure whether she's present. Uh, Vimala, ma'am, are you present? So she is the, she is actually managing an NGO, Shakti. Okay, so Vimla Nandakumar is an amazing writer as well. So she has written this article based on real world conflict management related, you know, the, the experiences she had or the experiences she might have uh, had by listening to other stories and narratives. So I would like to congratulate Srimati Vimla Nandakumar ma'am as well. And kudos to you for that amazing work with the NGO. Thank you, Vimla, ma'am. Okay. So next uh, we have is uh, Kriba Jacob, ma'am, because we'll have her words and then we'll have the chief guest words. Kriba Jacob, ma'am, are you there? I'm in a position to speak. I'm really sorry for ah. all the... No issues. No issues. Yeah. Here. Please go ahead with your speech. Uh, Thank you we... so much, Manjuman, for inviting me here. I feel very guilty for not being able to <laughs> join fully. And uh, first of all, I would like to congratulate all the young people who have done an amazing job. Uh, I would I would personally say that Manju uh, ma'am is a great mentor. Yes, she has been a great person in mentoring my life as well as in communication as well as in leadership. 
what all leadership or anything in those masters or any kind of inspiration i had the seed was put by her so i feel that all the students have blessed to have her as personal mentor and wishing all the young kids great aspiration <laughs> to really great i feel really jealous too i was not given an opportunity as a kid or as a college student so i have missed it a lot so i feel very jealous and i feel very happy for all these kids so whatever you wish for it is all going to happen thank you so much ma'am thank you so much all i i want to thank kriba because see, one more thing is you are watching kriba today she is an upcoming author as in she has already designed her book cover eyes wide open eyes wide open it's a detective story horror detective i think in that genre right so it will be coming up in 2023 i, I hope priva i know you are really busy she is area director right now in toastmaster she is also editor working as an editor in the technical realm she is a civil engineer turned editor because her passion was always to write or work with books she loves reading and some of the books that i have read in the recent years is because i saw her read and then uh, do a book review or something that's when i hear of that book who oh, kriba you read that book wow okay so she keeps uh, herself up to date with all the book launches happening across the world and she recommends you know very unique set of books to me as well thank you so much kriba for helping me grow as a, a person as well by exposing me to new books and this so hope to see you join author pm unni's uh, circle of being yeah, an amazon sure. selling author yes. god willing this year yes let's yes. <laughs> okay so all the best kriva yes thank, thank you. you so now we come uh, to the uh, we have some uh, certificates but that will distribute at the end i would like to request our uh, national award winning mm -hmm. ma'am Pramila Raj, uh, she is also the uh, she is a unique person because she is a person who ran marathon not only in India but also in New York. That too at the age of fifty four she ran in New York. I can't imagine uh, you know running at the age of fifty four. Forget marathon. If you ask me to run hundred meter, will I be able to run? I'm forty three, so going to become for, uh, I'm not forty four, but I don't think at fifty four I'll be able to run marathons. Now at sixty eight, she has completed hundred and seven marathons today because we invited her to the book club. She missed a hundred and eighth marathon today morning. There was a marathon. She said, if I go for the marathon, I'll miss this event. that is her commitment she doesn't if she gives a word it's a word she said 4:15 she came at 2:30 she said manji when are you going to open the zoom <laughs> 3:30 she was the i'm like okay usually chief guest comes late right chief guest i thought 4:15 means she she may come at 4:30 so i was really amazed no wonder she got national award and that too she had the unique privilege i wish I uh, I wish I had that privilege of meeting Dr. Abdul Kalam in person. In person, just spoken to Abdul Kalam, I get goosebumps by just listening to that. You know, oh my God! So Pramila Raj, ma'am, she also got a uh, this Nehru uh, Rochester Fellowship, right? Uh, that's from a foundation. So it's from US. From the she was invited. She got a fully paid uh, trip to US. she was asked to teach youngsters in new york english literature that to american literature because she has specialized in american literature so in indian going to us teaching the us kids american literature is unheard of right that is shrimati pramila raj for you multi faceted person not only an athlete but a wonderful writer you will see her speak today and i would like to tell you a book is coming up soon she is telling oh i am late i am 68 i said ma'am we want to read not just one book from you several books from you her book first book is titled my voice of victory so that too we are hoping that it be by god's grace and blessing she would be bringing it out this year and it, it has been my privilege to help her as an author coach so i would say in my life it's like uh, next best thing to probably meeting kalam is you know being her author coach so over to shrimati pramila raj uh, for her address as the chief guest okay it's a booming good afternoon or good evening to everybody uh, i think i'm completely bowled over 
and i was on the verge of thinking whether i'll do it or not to be or not to be that is the question according to hamlet but now you know when i saw all these young kids who have done so much uh, it has made my determination stronger and i think manju ma'am my book uh, voice of victory will definitely come out very quickly because when young children can do it you just see all these young kids uh, what about me who's old enough i think i can uh, compete and complete my work at least by the end of the year uh, there are so many things which crop up and stop you from doing your work but at the old age but at the same time when you have the determination and you have the perseverance anything can be achieved and uh, first of all it's my heartiest congratulations to all these youngsters who have done a wonderful job i am impressed ma'am completely impressed and i told ma'am also it's uh, not only in chennai come over to the other places and please inspire and motivate the younger generation in other places also now friends every day uh, starts with some expectation we expect so many things but ends up with some experience so i know your coaching has ended up in a lot of experience which you have gained all these days this is like so enjoy every day grand wishes on this auspicious day to my enterprising energetic young nine budding writers you're going to go a long way my young friends whose book the unforgettable incidents being launched today guided motivated and inspired by ted coach and author manju k manohar my sincere appreciation ma'am it comes right from my heart because i know how you have been inspiring me to go on with my work and her team for taking them on the wings of fancy uh, one small step for man is a giant leap for mankind budding blossoms my young children nothing comes the easy way nothing comes the easy way life is not a cake walk it calls for hard work practice which is needed to make a world champion like usain bolt determination have you seen the world cup who won the world cup did you see it it calls for hard work perseverance sweat and also tears to nourish a person called line messi until you spread your wings children you have no idea how far you can fly beginning you must not have had the idea what i am going to do it's only going to be book writing but today when the launch of the book you can understand where you are what you are going to achieve in life how you are going to achieve all these things in life it is just a small step life is about creating yourself so here you are making your dreams a reality with creative writing just a doubt to be leaders of a new world mastering the art of creativity designing being focused writing with a purpose and reading you have come a long way and really have become powerhouses of knowledge in by your book unforgettable incident this writing is not only going to help you in learning and writing a book but also in class where you are going to become more focused you understand what is reading what is writing how i can go a long way instead of admiring you look at the sky evening sky how beautiful it is you admire looking at the sky touch the sky nay friends don't just touch the sky go beyond that that's creativity my best wishes to all of you your efforts are laudable be the change you want to see in the world with one aim one purpose march on you are all young warriors to take on the world there's a road which is not trodden the other side of the road less travel is always there for you to see to achieve to conquer to become ignited minds like abdul kalam the future of india and i quote the famous famous president of mine whom i received the award this was the lines which he liked the most if you can dream friends if you can dream and make dreams your reality yours is the world and everything that's in it i repeat if you can dream and make dreams your reality yours is the world and everything that in it that is in it jai hind thank you friends ma'am if it is a real in person event we would have all given you a standing ovation but no. now 
on Zoom, I think we can give you all a heart sign to show you, our ma'am. appreciation for this. I would say these gems of wisdom, nuggets of, I would say, inspiration. Right? You have woven beautifully woven those words from Kalam. Uh, when he, when I heard the word ignited the first time, I was like having goosebumps. I'm sure all are delighted to hear these words from our chief guest, Pramila Raj, ma'am. Thank so, you, ma'am. Yeah, ma'am, as a humble token of appreciation, we have uh, uh, mementos for you. We will be sending to your address for uh, Chief Guest Pramila Raj, Guest of Honor, Coach Manita, and of course, Guest of Honor Kirba Jeka. We'll be sending it to your address. But now we have a certificate. Uh, so please accept this humble token of appreciation. Thank from you, me. ma'am. It's a pleasure Thank being with you all, ma'am, especially these kids. It was an evening well spent, ma'am. Yes. So author Dishit Balaji is also uh, there now on video. I hope if other authors are also able to come on video, that would be great. We'll spotlight them as well. Yes. Nitisha, if you're able to come on video, that would be great. Yeah. So we now move on to presenting a humble token of appreciation, a certificate for Chief Guest Pramila Raj, Guest of Honor Coach Manita, and uh, Kriva Jacob, editor, etc. <laughs> So let's put our hands together and thank, thank you, ma'am. Yes, Pramila Raj. Yes, ma'am. I'm sure it'll, this will become an unforgettable incident. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> for everyone, meeting you, meeting all of you, hearing Not all your words. It's an incident for me meeting all these young kids, ma'am. <laughs> it's touched the core of my heart, ma'am. Yes. <laughs> Okay, so next we have a humble token of appreciation for Coach Manita Gupta for being the guest of honor for the book launch and, you know, the energy she brought to the table, right? Uh, that is totally unexpected. Even I was like, if I ask, if she asked me, will she ask Manju, describe an adjective, give an adjective for you with him? I was thinking. <laughs> so that's Coach uh, Manita. She's also a trainer. She's a corporate trainer. She's also VP education for Charismatic Speakers Toastmasters Club. And of course, as I mentioned, she was the winner of the impromptu speech contest held at Charismatic Toastmasters recently. Yes. Thank next you so much, Coach Manju. And before you move to the next certification, let me just take this honor to tell you that there is a takeaway that I'm taking from here. It was not my energy. It was the vibes that were coming from these young authors. My yeah. takeaways have been inspired today. Maybe some year you will see me as an author. <laughs> Definitely. You and would. yes, I love the platform where a daughter is coming and receiving on behalf of father and mother is receiving on behalf of son. Beautiful words. So thank yeah. you so much for giving me the honor. Thank you. Yes. Thank you so much, Coach Vanita. Next, we move on to Kriba Jacob. So she is an engineer turned editor. She works in the technical realm. She edits books. And of course, she's an area director at Toastmasters International. So thank you, Kriba Jacob, ma'am. So she had some internet issue. Despite that, thankfully, she was able to give her speech. I was really worried whether she can come on video. Thank you so much. Next, we have, uh, this is something little, I would say embarrassing because I had to ask author P.A. Muni uh, to present his own certificate. So author P.A. Muni, please come on video. Are you there, author? Yes, he is the author of Kitchen Details. He is the author of Kitchen Details. And I asked him because I saw his standard of uh, English. I was really impressed. I said, can you help with the proofreading of this uh, particular book? And he kindly agreed. Uh, of course, it was di difficult because he was uh, juggling his book related work as well because he had a book fair uh, where he was representing his uh, publishing company and selling, he had to be there in person. So despite that, he still uh, gave some time for our book also, unforgettable incident. So thank you so much, author P.M. Muni. For... Yes, ma'am. Thank you for that. It's been a pleasure working with you, working with all these kids. It's been, uh, we get a glimpse into their kind of thought process and uh, uh, what they're trying to convey. And I think it's been a very good experience to uh, work with uh, these uh, young authors and, uh, you know, uh, editing their works. It's yes. been a, a very good experience for me. And thank you for that. Thank you so much, Arthur. Actually, many of you don't know him, but he knows all of you because he has read your articles. He's like, yes, and yes. yeah, every time you change, sometimes we have, uh, you know, certain 
uh, article sometimes we we discuss and then sometimes we change the uh, change the words a bit and all so that's after discussion with the author pia muni and athira t now athira t i don't know if she is in a position to turn on her, on her video she is uh, she has been really helping with the proof reading athira t what's special about her she's a young achiever she has won a gold medal from the president of india while she was at school yes you heard it right before the age of 17 she got gold medal from the president of india right now she is preparing for her b school exams i think today also she is having some test and all so i'm not sure whether she can come on video is she there yes she is the wonderful okay athira so this is presenting athira she also hopes to write a book in the future so let me see if athira is there one second Yes, Adra is present. Can you see Adra, all of you? Yeah. So I hope you can see Adra now, right? Yes. So that is Adra T. So she is also, uh, because sometimes you know, when we look at a particular, uh, particular story or certain words, uh, we have discussions between us. She says in, because I, I may be used to US English, she says in British English, it's told like this. So then we have a discussion on that and we, it's not like we just blindly approve whatever you write. In the editorial team, we had our own, I would say, a share of discussion, disagreement. So we have it in a very, uh, I, I respect both of them a lot. Author PM Muni as well as authority. Because I believe that uh, respect is something which you should have not for age but for their uh, talent so that's why if you see uh, Vivan if he writes something yes we should respect him because it's not age that matters but talent and what you bring to the table so I have immense respect for Adhra T because she uh, in a polite manner she will put across her views ma'am but in British English it is like this because I'm used to the US English so even the words organization you know Z is used in US but this book we had to do it in British so it's like Z should be S so yeah okay so that's Adhra T so she has a unique ability to uh, avoid conflicts because she puts you saw her no? she'll be smiling and then she if you put her with Donald Trump she will smile and then you know this is how it is make him a Agree to what she says. So, wishing you all the best, Adra. So, I think you can take blessings of Coach uh, uh, Manita, Chief Guest Pramila Raj, uh, Kriba Jacob as well for your upcoming exams. Adra, all the very best. Loved your charming smile. And yes, this is an art to put forward your words in front of a perfectionist like Manju Ma. Right, smile. 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 <laughs> Yeah, not easy to work with me, but yeah, but they did such a great job. <laughs> okay, so thank you, one and all. And once again, thanking the Navaratnas. Navaratnas are the authors. So Nishit Balaji, request, uh, author PM will need to present Nishit Balaji's certificate once again, because uh, despite his school related some expo commitment and his parents being away at the hospital, this young uh, author has made it on video. So let's have just we present it and then we'll wind up the show. So his certificate will present. So we'll have Coach Manita and Chief Guest Pramila Raj. Uh, I think Kriba is unable to come on video, but we'll have them congratulate author Nishit Balaji. I would like to call them Navaratnas because these nine children, right? Those who wrote The Race Against Time by Avantika B, To Fall in Love with Yourself by Aneshwara Anil from Qatar. Dear examiner, please be kind by Gautam R. I love that. Feathers. <laughs> yeah, Fallen Feathers, feathers by Nitisha V from Puducherry. The Boon of Friendship, Nishit Balaji, Hosur. A full to the brim with joy, Priyank Bummer from Chennai. On bright smiles and spreading positive, Trishna Venugopal from Mumbai. At the Kabini Jungle Resort, originally he had titled as Trip to Kabini by Vivan Krishna, who is the youngest uh, participant. And the unforgettable lesson by the humorous uh, Zia Remis. Okay, so I call them Navaratnas because these are nine authors. You should look out for because even the title you'll see, you know, the kind of talent they are having, right? The fallen uh, feathers and raise against time, how they have structured the articles. It was a delight for me as their coach because it is not just writing. It is also a course on designing book covers, designing marketing posters, 
what goes behind the book you know you need to market the book so they learned that how to work with each other like they mentored uh, some of the others those who know canva taught others those who are good at words helped others anushara is amazing with words so she helped others with you know uh, how to restructure their articles so it's like you know helping each other collaborating right if all world the entire world comes together uh, we all help each other excel right isn't that a wonderful concept i think these nine uh, gems navaratnas they did just that and author nishit balaji we want to thank uh, chief guest pramila raj and guest of honor coach manita and of course uh, Uh, Kriba Jacob and of course our uh, editing team Unni, author Unni and Kriba J. Uh, sorry, Adhra T. Thank you everyone for making my dream come true. Actually, it was a, a long dream of mine to become an author for many years. Uh, it was the help of you guys who, so that I came the, to where I am today. Thank you, Nishir. Yes. <laughs> so that. I think you know that sums up our this. So thank you so much, Author Unni. She he was the co-host for the Zoom as well, and uh, wish to thank uh, all the authors once again. Let me spotlight all the authors who are are on video. Nitisha is the so all of you as soon as because they we have put it on Amazon. It will appear in another twenty four to forty eight hours. The book will be there as soon as the book link is ready. We will share with all of you. It's an e-book link. The paperback link, as we mentioned, will be by Feb second week. So Feb third week, we will be having a uh, third or fourth week. We'll be having another event where we'll be giving the certificates for best performance in class. You remember, in class we had points for various activities, right? For that. who comes on time all the children all the children were so punctual they used to come ahead of time correct everyone every single time ahead of time so we had points for that so we'll see all that uh, third week or fourth week of february okay we will be uh, there to cheer you for your paperback but for now it will be kindle version will be up another 24 to 48 hours it will be up and once it's up all of you please uh, do read and give your feedback as well i request coach manita kirba jacob uh, 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 everyone else assembled here to please read the kindle as well as paperback and send your words of uh, uh, appreciation of course your guidance also for all these authors so that they can come up and they are the future leaders of our world right so if we help them at this stage i'm sure they will lead our world our earth to a better uh, better future right i think abraham lincoln said uh, the best way to create best way to predict your future is to create it i think these are the young children the leaders who are going to create our future also because uh, if we have the right leaders leading the world i'm sure the world will be a better place so thanking these nine authors and the entire editorial team umi and adra and the publishers clever fox publishers and we have our guest of honor coach manita kirba jacob all the parents grandparents relatives assembled here and my own parents mini manohar and dad manohar they are my parents and our chief guest because as per protocol we have to always keep chief guest to the last i did not know this until recently so someone told me that national award should be kept so last but not the least our chief guest pramila raj ma'am for coming today and i would say this would become one of the memorable moments of our lives right meeting a person meeting all these young authors so So with this, I would like to wish you all the best and end with my favorite quote by uh, the world famous, you know, the Mickey Mouse creator, right? The creator of Mickey Mouse and Donald Duck, Walt Disney. Uh, I was born on uh, the same day, but okay. not on the same year. Of course, I'm yet much younger to him. <laughs> so Walt Disney and me were born on the same day, December fifth. So he said, "If you can dream it." you can do it and that's exactly what kalam also said kalam in words yeah he said it different words like what this is you know all the great people they say the same thing you know in some other because they all discovered the way to greatness and the way to greatness is through hard work humility and uh, i would say resilience resilience and perseverance 
if you put all these four together you will get success you will get greatness you will be able to go beyond the skies like our chief yes pramila raj ma'am said okay so all the best to everyone so our oh, srimati vimala ma'am is there so shall we also present her certificate author only i'm so happy ma'am ma'am would you like to come on video we did call your name and we did have the certificate distribution earlier ma'am i'm so sorry i just uh, came out i got okay. delayed when i born out so no sorry but no i'm so glad i could see all of you yes and, uh, you know here uh, i've been here for the past uh, half an hour or 40 minutes oh, okay ma'am so, we had your certificate decision much early ma'am so i think we oh, missed you narrowly. i'm so sorry and i'm so glad that uh, i am here and i could see all the young authors faces at least <laughs> and uh, the guest of honor and the special guest all of them manju it's a wonderful wonderful initiative and uh, looking forward to reading the book thank you so much ma'am thank you so much uh, so this book uh, the one which we are having is unforgettable incidents by the young uh, children my right book on. will be launched in march ma'am step by step okay. conflict management so do Super. do read this young uh, author's book also unforgettable incident it will come on amazon within 24 to 48 hours and paperback also ma'am my thought is i'll send you their book by okay. uh, post as well as an additional Uh, memento from my end because i'm sure they would be delighted to hear from a person like you you work in the space of ngo shakti right so yeah. thank you so much ma'am it's it's really thank you manju it is wonderful being with all of you yes thank you so much i would like to thank all the parents even grandfather of nitisha joined so i'm so excited so i would like to uh, end the meeting of awesome. thank you grandparents also ma'am yes yes thank you Thank you so much. Thank you so much, everyone. So I am now ending the recording, and we will uh, officially end the meeting also now. Thank you so much. So remember, you, if you can, yeah, yeah. If you can dream it, you can do it. Yeah. If you can God dream it, you can do it. Yeah. Thank God you so much. Thank you.